your diagnosis is a lumbar degenerative scoliosis and superimposed in that scoliosis or curvature are multiple segments of mechanical instability or spondylolisthesis. Given your failure of multimodal conservative therapies up to this point, and given your persistence of disabling mechanical back and nerve pain, my recommendation for most efficient and effective treatment would be to perform a multi-level posterior spinal fusion or reconstruction. There are many different options we have available when performing fusion. Some include minimally invasive approaches from the front of the spine, from the side, or approaches to the posterior aspect of the spine. In your case, given the deformity plus severe central stenosis, we can most effectively and efficiently treat this via the posterior approach. Through that approach, a midline incision is made that allows me to place pedicle screw instrumentation into the spine. That fixation allows me to correct the position of the spine and stabilize the unstable segment. Segments. Once that is done, I'm then able to make a keyhole opening into the back of the spine to alleviate the pressure on the nerves and therefore alleviate the leg symptoms that you present with today. That operation in your case will take between two and three hours. You would typically stay in the hospital between two and three nights uh, of inpatient care. For the first three months, I have you focus on regaining your cardiovascular stamina through walking, recumbent or stationary bicycle use, or even an elliptical trainer. I have you avoid lifting heavy objects more than 20 to 25 pounds, and particularly avoid torsional type activities such as golf or tennis. At the three month mark follow up, we begin an outpatient physical therapy protocol to focus on uh, core stabilization exercises and modalities. By six months, once we've confirmed via radiographs or x rays that the fusion is solid and healed, we begin lifting all restrictions. I let patients bathe or shower right away, but have you avoid swimming pools, bathtubs, or hot tubs for three weeks. My team and I are here 24 hours a day to answer any questions that may arise now or at any point in the postoperative recovery period. We look forward to taking care of you.